Alright, I switched my little camera now. So I can actually work without having a hand on the camera. <laughs> I'm about to start doing some more of my red. I'm just sort of letting it push out of the machine as I'm doing it. I don't have a lot of bobbin left, but I'd like to at least try and do this piece. Get the scallops on this thing. <laughs> Pencil mark doesn't hold up for long, that's why you kind of have to do it the same day. Oops, it's getting a little out of control, so I have to do an extra pivot here. Check on my bobbin. Yeah, I should be able to finish this piece and then I'll probably have to roll a new one. As I mentioned, my machine doesn't have bells and whistles, so it doesn't automatically move the needle up. It makes it convenient when you know exactly how to let off the pedal to stop it where you want to. Straight stitch, easy. Fast. <laughs> and I'm not doing any back stitching because I know this is probably going to be too big for what I need. I don't know how easy this is to see. I've got my stitching here and now I just need to cut it back like I did on the yellow and put in my little crimps. I've got my bow pieces and then some straightaways to go, but oh, my bobbin is out. Alright, so I've got my bobbin reloaded and I'm just going to continue sewing. Got a lot of pieces to get through just to finish up this color before I can iron and flip things. <laughs> straightaways are easy. one thing I always tell people, sewing is easy. You're just putting two pieces of fabric together and stitching. It's really not complicated unless you do something complicated.
close this hope thing up a little bit, not much. And that way when I turn it inside out, it won't be as big of a hole I'll have to close. Same thing for the next pieces and the last straight away. <laughs> 